for our final server component pattern, let's explore working with context providers. If you're familiar with React, you know that context providers typically live near the root of an application to share global state and logic. For example, your application's theme. However, there is a catch with the RSC architecture. React context is not supported in server components. If you try to create a context at your application's root, you will run into an error. The solution is to create your context and render its provider inside a dedicated client component. Let me show you how this works in VS Code. We start with layout.tsx in the app folder. Here, let's set up and provide a theme context that our entire application can use. Import create context from React. Next, we define the theme type, which has colors as an object, primary of type string, secondary of type string as well. Next, we define the default theme. So default theme of type theme, colors object, define a primary color and a secondary color. Next, we define const theme context is equal to create context of type theme and we pass in the default theme. Finally, we wrap the body tag with theme context dot provider. Value is equal to default theme and we add the closing tag. When we save this and check our browser, we will see an error. You're importing a component that needs create context. This React hook only works in a client component. Now we could add the use client directive to make layout.tsx a client component, but that would tell Next.js to run this component and everything it imports on the client side. That is not what we want. Instead, let's create our context and render its provider in a separate client component. In the components folder, let's create a new file called theme-provider tsx. Since we have seen the code already, I'll paste it here to save us some time. Let's break this down. We've got our type, default theme, and theme context creation just like before. We are now exporting a theme provider component that renders theme context dot provider with our default theme value and renders any children passed to it. I have also added a convenient use theme hook that any component can use to access the theme. But the most important part is the use client directive at the top. Back in layout.tsx, we can now simplify our code with the theme provider. Delete create context import, and instead import the theme provider from our theme provider.tsx file. Delete the code for type theme, the default theme, the context creation, and for the JSX, specify the theme provider component. To test this out, let's use our theme context in the client route page. So in page.tsx, which is a client component, import the use theme hook and use it to access the theme. Const theme is equal to use theme. And for the JSX, we will delete the carousel code and apply the primary color to an H1 element. Client route page. And we're going to specify inline styles. Color, theme.colors.primary. The component is now a very simple component. In the browser, head to slash client route, and you'll see the client route page in our primary blue color. Switch it to secondary, and it turns gray. Our theme provider is working as expected. Now here is something important to make note of. Even though we are wrapping our application in a client component, which is theme provider, server components further down the tree stay as server components. We will explore this concept more deeply pretty soon, but this is the key to working with context providers and server components. Instead of converting your server component to a client component, create a new client component and use it within your server component with the children props. If you're using React version 19, you can render just context as a provider instead of context.provider. So theme context.provider can be rendered as just theme context. Head to the browser, refresh, and you will continue to see the same result. All right, 
Up next, let's dive into client component patterns. Supporting the channel is free. Please like and subscribe. It helps a lot.